sounds like it's uh, recording. Yeah, it's recording. So I better, uh, since this is recording, I better get on the ball and start reading. But you know, since um, this is off my laptop, and not uh, this camera here. Uh, I'm going to be uh, bringing my attention to this camera here. Because I have a feeling that this video is going to be deleted uh, due to a blamer saying, uh, make no mistake, uh, there must be no feature for those that would slander the prophet of Islam. And when you just expose stuff on the internet that uh, uh, seems to show Islam in a bad light, that's usually considered slandering the prophet of Islam. So. I'll direct my attention to this one rather than that one there. Okay. Anyway, guess what I discovered? And this was over a year ago. Uh, Muslims are apparently, they're starting to throw the Quran away. Uh, I'll read this article to you from uh, the Shubat Foundation. He, uh, Shubat is, uh, Wally Shubat, he used to be a Muslim. He became a Christian, I think. Anyway, uh, he, he said this. Uh, but really, uh, it's not just Shubat. I've, I've seen other ones where, uh, other articles uh, dealing with uh, Muslims throwing the Quran away into the sewer. So, I'll sh maybe I'll make a video of that, too. When Jones was arrested this past September 11th on a felony charge for hauling nearly 3,000 copies of the Quran to park in Mulberry, the world was up in arms because he planned to set them on fire. The felony charge he faces is for illegally transporting flammable materials in the form of nearly 3,000 kerosene-soaked copies of the Quran, Islam's holy book. Right, and like that guy that was arrested for making that video... Uh, was arrested for uh, just making videos, right? <laughs> that video that uh, called the innocence of Muslims, which uh, uh, supposedly caused Benghazi, right? Okay, Jones will be in be on probation for six months and was banned from Polk County. That means he will not be able to carry out his plan to burn Korans in the county on September 11, 2014. While media focuses. While media focuses on Jones, sources at shubat.com obtained reveal. Reveals that some Muslims got tired of the Quran and decided to dump them. From Saudi Arabia to Pakistan, there are several cases of Muslims dumping Korans in dumpsters and even the local sewage in the, in the, holiest, in the most holy, uh, holiest place in, in Islam, Saudi Arabia. Last year, a ton of Korans were discovered in the local, local sewage in Taif. Saudi Arabia, and I'll show it to you. I'll show, I'll show some of the books here. See here. Yeah, is that something? There's the drink. That's the sewer, the sewer where they got them from. Those are Korans, as you can tell. Another uh, another picture of it. 
can see there, Karans. All right. The story began when a complaint was filled was filed as a child found a Koran nearby the sewage drain. Saudi police began to investigate and found Korans oozing with feces in the local sewage. The Saudi government had to pump out huge amounts of sewage material and began an effort to restore the Korans. In Pakistan, the problem was similar, in which tons of Korans are found in local dumpsters. When one American when one American decides to burn Korans, the whole world focuses on America. But when in the Muslim world, tons of Korans are mingled with human excrement, no news media cares. I wonder why. When one when one man decides to burn the Quran in America, almost all America condemns him. Yet Americans demonstrate by the millions for call. Yet Muslims, yet the Muslims demonstrate by the millions, calling for America's destruction. The Muslim world should demonstrate by should demonstrate by the million uh, with banners in hand that says one man wanted to burn our Quran and the whole country went against him. <laughs> uh, why isn't this case? Why isn't this ever the case? I rest my case while he chew back. So anyway, is it interesting? Muslims are dumping the Quran, and this is just a year ago. Yeah, I'm wondering. Maybe they are discovering in the Quran that uh, it infers that embryos go through a blood clot stage, that the Earth is spread out. Um, and mountains are cast, put are, are placed down on the earth as pegs to keep the earth from being destroyed, which according to Muhammad is uh, due to the earth being spread out with seven other earths on the back of a giant fish called Nun. Or that uh, the Quran says it confirms before scriptures that all Muslims believe to be uh, corrupted. They believe the Bible is corrupted, and yet the Quran says it confirms the before scriptures. So maybe that's why they're throwing them in there, or, you know, or the... Oh, the fact that it allows women to be beaten if you just fear rebellion from them makes you wonder. But 